Next, we're gonna move on to the speed of the feed accelerator. The speed of the feed accelerator is dictated by these two pulleys right here. You've got high speed and low speed. Standard low speed out of the factory is 430 RPM. There's an optional low speed, slow speed kit you can put on, and that's gonna reduce the speed down to 310 RPM. What that's gonna give you is more gentler crop handling into the, into the rotor of the machine. What we're finding is we're finding a lot of damage because the crop is being beat up against with this feed accelerator. On the feed accelerator, there's wear strips. They're the serrated strips that are on the, on the feed accelerator. This is a standard feed accelerator strip that comes. On the edge, it is chamfered just a little bit. That is when you want to install the leading edge onto the feed accelerator. It's going to be gentler on the crop. Here's a worn feed accelerator strip. As long as you're not having feeding issues, this is perfect. This is conditioned, it's, the sharp edges are worn off. This will give you a nice gentle, gentle intake into the rotor, but yet be gentle on the crop. Another optional strip that is what we're actually recommending is if you're gonna replace your strips, this is a swept back strip, wear strip. It's also called edible bean strip. What this is, is it's gonna, as, as it comes into the crop, it's gonna give it a little bit of an angle onto the corn. It's not that you're gonna be quite as aggressive, but it's gonna you, give you the same feed characteristics going in. There again, we're trying to eliminate sharp contact onto that cob of corn to eliminate kernel damage or cob damage as it goes in. Here again, this is the recommended one if you're going to change to put in your machine. So there is another option, a third option for the feed accelerator strip. This is a smooth strip as this one does not have any of the serrations on it. This would be for your popcorn, a food grade crop, or something you were looking for more gentle or less aggressive in your feed accelerator. Now when you go to the 700 series combines, they've changed the serrations all together and they've made them a little bit shorter and more blunt as it goes. These seem to be working well for us in the 700 series and as they wear and get uh, the sharp edges worn off, we're having good performance with these. Recommended just leave these in the 700 series.